Professor Edward Irugumayo, who was the Speaker of Parliament from 1979 to 1980 after the hosting of Idi Amin Dada, Francis Butagira, who served as Chairman of the National Assembly in the Fourth Parliament from 1980 to 1985. Alhaj Moses Chigongo, who served in the Fifth Parliament as the Vice Chairman of National Resistance Council from 1980 to 1996. Edward Chiwanuka Sekandi served from 2001 to 2011. These are former speakers of Parliament who have been gifted with brand new cars. The speaker Anita Anetamong presented these cars to them in a ceremony that was held at Parliament. The Parliamentary Commission is also extending the same benefits, but limited to the monetary terms to the former speakers and deputy speakers who either died in office or in retirement. We are providing them those benefits. I know that all of you are living in, all of you, the living speakers and deputy speakers are already getting your monetary benefits from the Parliamentary Commission. According to the speaker, fueling of these cars, maintenance, salaries of the drivers will be covered by Parliament, announcing also that these former speakers will be provided with brand new cars every after five years. Feel free when you want to come over. When you see that there is something wrong that we are doing that needs to be corrected, we are always open to any advice. Rebecca Kadaga, though absent, her car was also present. But as Parliament of Uganda, 11th Parliament of Uganda, we, pre we, we thought it wise to appreciate you when you're still alive. And I want to thank the members of parliament who felt and thought it wise that we must appreciate you. <laughs> so we are supposed to look after you as per the act, and we are doing this because of the act. You see, it's not really for us, but to recognize that we made some contribution to this country speaks a lot of volume because the country is like a stage. We play our part and go. But to be forgotten is a terrible thing. Among other benefits that a former speaker gets include a new housing allowance of 300 million shillings, a monthly pension of shillings 6.7 million, 6.4 million annually for medical treatment, two security guards all paid shillings 1.1 million per month, a senior personal secretary paid shillings 10.8 8 million annually, among others. Shamim Naiga and Gloria Gutabinji, UBC News.